New at 5, September traditionally National Prostate Cancer Awareness Month. More than 200 men, 200,000 men diagnosed with prostate cancer annually. 32,000 will die from it every year. But there's a new treatment at the University of Colorado Cancer Center, improving the quality of life for some prostate cancer patients. You'd never be able to tell by looking at David Sutton that he's been battling prostate cancer for more than a decade. Going on my 12th year, I've had it for 11 years, um, and I had the highest grade, the uh, most aggressive cancer that you could have. A couple of months ago, this wouldn't have been possible for David. Life was not worth it, basically, for for uh, for the pain that I was going through. David is the first patient at the University of Colorado Hospital to receive a new treatment that fights the pain of terminal prostate cancer. The timing was right for David in that radium-223 was disapproved by the FDA uh, a couple of months ago. Within six hours, I was totally pain-free. I had uh, no uh, skeletal muscular pain whatsoever. The injection searches for and targets the cancer in the bones of patients. We also saw improvement in survival in terms of helping people live longer. It hasn't helped my golf swing at all, but I am totally pain free and able to have a uh, basically have a life now. So far, David hasn't experienced any side effects, just a little rust on his golf game. So I've uh, beaten the odds for a number of years. Uh, and this makes beating the ads even more worthwhile for me. David's participated in several cancer trials, but radium-223 has been the most successful. I think it is a very um, exciting time in um, cancer um, therapy and cancer research. Seven more patients are scheduled to receive injections this month. The University of Colorado continuing to be at the cutting edge of prostate cancer detection, prevention, and treatment.